Well, new for you tonight, Southern University leaders clear up confusion after issuing a mask mandate for the first day of class and then changing it hours later. Yeah, Fox 44's Jessica Knox spoke with a few students over their concerns. Jessica, what are they saying? Hey, Kellyanne and Tavarius. Students tell me they're going to play it safe because the pandemic is not over. The confusion started when the university decided to only pull a mask mandate for the students in the law center. Early Monday, Southern University and A&M College announced they will reinforce mass mandate for everyone on campus. But after looking at the data, the university decided masks will no longer be mandatory, saying in a statement, quote, upon further review of COVID-19 vaccination rates and other mitigation efforts, the Southern University system will not make mask mandatory on its campuses. Basically being responsible for everyone's safety since, I mean, COVID is still here, so I feel like it is necessary and people should still wear their masks. However, some students like Kennedy McKnight say they are still wearing their masks to protect themselves and others. It should be mandatory everywhere. Our law department is a lot of people from various communities, ages, and comes from various backgrounds and family. But at the law center, students will be required to mask up. The mandate will stay in place at all the law center buildings on campus until the foreseeable future. Students say it is for the best. So to know that I'm not getting someone else sick that has a family that comes to school here or are elderly and things like that is very important to me because we're in such close vicinities. Like. Now, we reached out to the Law Center, but no one was able to comment on why they're actually bringing back the mask mandate. Southern University will still require students to be vaccinated in order to be on campus and to attend classes. Jessica Knox, Fox 44 News. All right, thanks, Jessica.